Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to a brand new WWE Supercard video, episode 128, I believe. I hope it is. I hope it is. Um, so yeah, RTG guys, and and everything else really. So let's let's just start off with King of the Ring. We're done. Done. Went out. Didn't even qualify for it really. So yeah, there we go. Let's get into RTG. Um, no, it, I'm not even going to talk about it because it was just symbolic really. Uh, woke up and I was like, oh. Is it over already? And then I was like, okay, well, yeah. It was going really well at first, and then it just kind of slowly, slowly drifted away from me. And then I was at a party last night, completely forgot to energize during it. Got home quite late. Um, got actually, like, I got, I, I got, I got here. Got my computer on and all that. I was when it's in Discord if anyone was on. Play a little bit of games of RTG, <laughs> and I still forgot King of the Ring. Um, so yeah, I don't know how I managed that, but and then I then I went to bed when I woke up. I was like, "Fuck, King of the Ring," and I got on it and I finished. I got Elite John Cena and Hardened Apollo Cruz. So yeah, nothing really too interesting on that note. So let's get into some uh, RTG. So I'm currently on the Miz. Ten points on the Miz. We've got three cars left to do. We've got a little bit over a day left on it. Again, I have failed once again. Because uh, at the beginning of this RTG, the first day I streamed, if you guys remember, I said I want to get it done in the first, like, two days. And obviously I failed massively again. So it's going to come down again to the last to the last day um, of me. Like It's going to come down to the last day to see whether if I'm going to get those two hardies or not. Probably going to. Not probably. I am going to go. I'm going to get them. It's just a matter of time, really. I'm going to be streaming uh, probably uh, like half an hour, an hour after this video goes up. So, yeah. I'll be live streaming on Twitch. I'll post a little video on the channel, by the way, uh, that I am streaming on Twitch. Um, when I'm streaming on Twitch. So I'll let you guys know all about that. And, um, yeah, I'm, again, I'm really, really sorry, guys, about the whole um, not uploading every day. It's just, it, I used to think it was really easy and I could keep doing it. But now I'm starting to realise the days go by so quickly. And I've got such a messed up kind of body clock and just a... A really kind of messed up life currently right now. Not not like not a life life, just the way I'm living each day. Um, you know, like I wake up and then it's like afternoon and then it's like friends are like, yeah, you want to come do something or I, you know, and then it just then my day gets lost really because I go out and then before I know it, I'm back here asleep and then another day's gone by. You know what I mean? So it's pretty hectic um, and it's pretty hard to try and get videos out for you guys every day. Again, I'm going to try my best, and I know before you guys say, but every, some people do two videos a day, and some people have gone like ten years or two years without missing an upload. Well, I'm just not those kind of people. I am seriously going to try my best, guys, to bring you enough content, but um, I prefer to give you guys, yeah, I prefer to give it, what's that, what's the expression? Quant no, um, quality over quantity. Quality over quantity. So if I can bring you guys an episode... I'm gonna try every day, but let's say let's say I'll bring you guys five episodes a week, and they're good instead of seven episodes that you know a couple of them are just a bit boring. I think that's definitely better. So we're gonna we're gonna try and aim for the best possible content. If it, if I just can't manage it every day, then uh, I hope you guys understand. But yeah, if there's something interesting and there's something for me to actually do in the game, you guys can count on a video up on that particular day. Except if there's just yeah. <laughs> Except if I don't upload on that day, then yeah, I kind of just never mind. A bit, I contradicted myself there a bit, but yeah, you got. I think you guys get what I mean. Um, so straw poll in in this video, guys. I won't forget the straw poll should be in the first, like the top link in this description. If it's not, when you guys are watching this, I you got you guys should you you guys get to be angry at me in the comments. You you got you tell me in the comments if I forget. And uh, and you guys, you guys would be allowed to be disappointed in me if I forgot again, but hopefully I won't. But yeah, um, yeah, we're less than a hundred subscribers away from that five k, that five k, which is just fantastic. So uh, yeah, again, just uh, just straw poll. Make sure you guys vote. If you you don't have to vote, um, but if you wanna, if you guys wanna have a say in what I'll be doing for five k, then make sure you guys do drop a little vote on the straw poll. It will take only a couple seconds. And yeah, so, okay, let's go with Stone Cold on there. It's, the games aren't getting too hard for me right now. They're not. They're still very, very easy to win. Like, most of them are perfect games. Hopefully, I'll be able to plus 10 the first event card. Will I have to do some plus 6s on Jeff? I don't know. I'm very surprised they did Matt and then Jeff. I thought they were going to do Jeff first, then Matt. Uh, because they did Matt, Jeff 
in RD, and then they're just get, they're kind of like giving people in uh, WrestleMania tier or no Ultimate tier, no WrestleMania tier, no ult, no. In wrestling, I don't, I don't even know. They basically, like, yeah, if people were just in, in the ring, Dom, if people couldn't have got the Jeff and only were able to get the Matt Hardy, um, and they kind of, you know, I thought Cat Daddy were going to be a little bit meaner about it and make Jeff the first one for, you know, that way people who only got the mat would have to go and finish it to actually like get the mat and would be the last card. So yeah, I'm surprised they didn't do that. It's actually nice of them to not have done that. So that's good. Well, it doesn't really change much for me, but it's good for you guys who only got um, Matt Hardy out there. It's, it's going to help you out because it's going to be the first card you're going to get. And if you didn't get Jeff, then you probably won't get Jeff in the RTG. So makes it does make sense. Uh, let's go Charisma with him. That should be a win there. Uh, this, yeah, this game is going to hopefully be a perfect game. So I wouldn't say at this point I really need to like... like if it's like if it calls power and speed, you know, I'm not going to be like, okay, so I'll go Randy Orton and then... That right now I'm not really focusing on. Like as long as my tags are compatible, I'm not really losing any games. So it's not, it's not. I'm not at the point where I have to like put my full concentration mode on in RTG. And thank God it's not that stage yet because RTG is boring enough. But when you have to concentrate to play RTG, it's even more boring. So, uh, so yeah. But let me know where you guys are in the RTG if you are going to get the Hardys. I, I know so many people already got the Hardys Pro. And some of some someone had like most, well not most people, but a lot of people already had the Hardys Pro after like the first 24, like 36 hours after the RTG came out, which is absolutely mental. Congrats to all of you guys. Um, but it will take me a little bit longer. And uh, I, don't, yeah, I don't see what's wrong with taking a little bit longer. I know I'm not the first to finish the events or the first to pro my event cards or... I'm not really the first for anything around in the, in the supercar community, but I prefer taking my time uh, than uh, than just rushing the whole thing. So yeah. Anyway, we're 20 games. We have to play 20 more games so before we get the Miz WrestleMania. Um, another single. Okay about it. I'm happy because it's a good card. I like him. A lot of you guys all know Miz is one of my favourites on the current roster right now. So uh, yeah, not disappointed on that aspect. Bit 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 disappointed. It's not a pro. But we can't have everything either. And I'm doing well. My decks are definitely doing really, really well. I've only got one more regular Ultimate Pro. And it is the best, well, join best. Um, and that is Seth Rollins. So that's really cool. And as soon as we get the Hardy Boys, we'll, yeah, like Stone Cold Ultimate Pro Throwback will be my worst card. It's just mental. Well, actually, technically, my worst card is Nijax. But when I say, like, I've only got one regular Ultimate Pro left, I mean, like, in the Superstars. I don't really mean in the Divas. So, But maybe the next the next event card could very well be a Diva. Because in Season 2... In, no, not in Season 2. Season 3, when Ultimate... You know, when then when, then, well, when Season 3 came out and all of that, the first event card was Goldberg. The second one was Shane O'Mac. The third one was Bret Hart. And then after Bret Hart, it was Alexa Bliss. So that is the fourth event card. We've already had um, Shawn Michaels, Brock Lesnar, Matt and Jeff now. And then hopefully the next one is, uh, is, is a diva. That'd be really, really cool. That'd be really cool. Definitely be really cool. If it's not, it's not, you know, it's, that's, uh, that's okay. I uh, hope, hopefully they'll give it to us soon. Uh, in the next, if, 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 if in the next, like, if the next two event cards aren't, isn't, like, at least one of them isn't a diva, then, uh, then I'll be a little bit disappointed, maybe even a bit angry, because, yeah, my, my Diva's definitely the weak part of my deck now. I haven't got a WrestleMania Pro Diva, and that's really what I'm looking for. I've only got Bailey in about 1,000 games, a bit more than well, 1,200 games. I'm going to give my Diva ladder reward, my female uh, ladder reward for 17,500 games, uh, which is a female, obviously, um, and that is gonna, that's going to help out. Now, if it's Bailey, that would be insane if it's not it's okay it's just another single and hopefully we will eventually get um a diva a diva pro but uh bailey bailey's what we're looking for bailey's definitely what we're looking for so as soon as we kind of hit that like 1000 maybe maybe a bit maybe a bit less maybe when we hit like 500 games away from that ladder we'll we'll, we'll start playing a bit of wild and try and grind it out because we want to get it as soon as possible uh hopefully by uh, and uh, may maybe by the end of uh, may maybe by the end of April, maybe by the end of April. I mean, like it's only it's, it's only the twenty second of April. Man, it goes so quick. It goes so quickly around it, around here, around everywhere. Really, time absolutely flies by. It is crazy, guys. I just I remember when we were still in two thousand sixteen. It was coming up like around Christmas time. I would. I was not. I hadn't. I hadn't even like been doing like supercard episodes on this channel for like a month yet, and 
I just remember that like I remember that like it was yesterday. It was it was awesome. And now we're like five months into this channel. Uh, everything is still going amazing thanks to all you guys. So yeah, thank you, thank you. And uh, I mean, when when I say time flies, I don't mean that in a well, not necessarily in a bad way. I mean there are some bad things about it, you know. Um, but that that's that on the personal side of shit, you know. I mean, it's not really important. I just mean when I say time flies, um, I mean like it's good that it's time that time flies because it means I'm not bored and it means I'm I don't know. It means I'm enjoying it and it means yeah. But when I'm or what I also say that time flies is a bit. It's a bit, it's a bit, it's a bit sad. Now I'll never be a kid again, really. I'm, I'm going to be 18 soon, and I don't know. When when you're a kid, or you die of just you, all you want is to be 18, or or to be whatever, like 21 if you're in America. But here, man, you just want to be 18. You just want to be like, oh yeah, I just want to be able to have a car and drink legally, or or do this or do that, go to a casino, all of those cool things, and just be an adult, and you know. Even if you, if you have big brothers, it's like times two that feeling. So um, older brothers, if you have younger brothers, maybe not. But if you have like older brothers, you want you want to be an adult. You want to be their age even more. You want to be eighteen. But then when you're like getting close to it, I mean, I mean, most of my friends are already like long gone, like that stage of being eighteen. I mean, most of them are like twenty one already now. So it's it's mental. But I'm I remember when I was fourteen, I was like, oh wait, to be eighteen, only four more years. Now in like nine months, I'm gonna be eighteen, and I'm like, fuck. I don't want to be 18. <laughs> I really don't want to be. It kind of sucks, man. It kind of sucks. It kind of sucks. Life, you know, life goes on, and it's hard to not. It's hard to not think about it. It's hard to be like. It's hard not to think like. I'm never gonna just be a kid again. You know that that stage of my life is just over, and there's nothing I can do about it to get back to that stage. So, it's it's scary. And then it's also exciting at the same time because you're like, my, the new another chapter of my life is going to start, but it is also very fucking terrifying. <laughs> but anyway, enough, um, enough, enough of that talk. We, you guys haven't, you didn't, you guys didn't come here to listen to, like about some fucking shit life stories or me worrying about that. That's not, that's not your guys' problems. That's mine. But if I'm just saying, if some of you guys out there feel like that, it's completely normal, and uh, it, it, yeah, it is completely normal. So we have almost finished this game off. Let's well, let's quickly be what halfway through it, and uh, yeah, let's quickly get this done. So straw poll. I'm gonna go ahead right now before I forget. I'm not gonna make one. We won't, we won't make the straw poll right now. Well, actually, maybe. Let me just go on uh, straw poll. Okay. God, I remember on Camcord making so many of these. Like every decision I wanted to make, I was like, okay, straw poll. <laughs> um, type your question here. What food I do for five K subs? Question mark because you know good English and shit. Uh, let me change my keyboard really quickly. There you go. Boom. So the question mark on my keyboard isn't the same. It's it's complicated. Anyway, power. Let's go with Seth. Don't know why the hell I went with Seth for power, but we just got away with that one. Um, enter poll option. So we've got talk about a live stream. Uh, I got a good one. If only I could spell. Okay, well, I'm, I'm gonna do it afterwards. I've already started it, so I'm not gonna forget now. Uh, so let's get this game over and done with, and then we'll like nicely end the episode there. And in a little bit, we'll be live streaming on Twitch. And also, I'd just like to add, because uh, you know, I always like talking a little bit of football when I can. I, I try not to talk too much football, but I'd like to wish Tottenham a very, very happy day, because they got kicked out of the FA Cup. And you know, fuck you, Tottenham fans. I say that with all the respect. Any of you guys out there who watch my channel are Tottenham fans, you know. It, it, it's good. It's all good. Um, I mean, I, I don't like Chelsea either, though. But when, when you have Chelsea, Tottenham, one-on-one, -on -one, it's like, who, who am I going to go for here? And I'm like, all right, well, fuck Tottenham. <laughs> and then you kind of... So it was 4-2. It was actually a really fun game to watch, you know. Like, as a complete neutral and as someone who hates both of those teams, it was sort of a fun game to watch. Good football played on both sides. Um, you know, you can, but you know, I'm I'm not I'm not someone who's I've, I've mentioned this a, long, a lot. If my team are just not up to form and just not playing well, 
and when there are teams that are just doing better than them, I'm not going to be like, oh yeah, they're shit and Arsenal are way better than them. No, they're doing way better than Arsenal and both of the teams, you can just tell that they're playing amazing football right now and deserve to be first and second in the league and in the semis and Chelsea in the final now of the FA Cup. It's, it's really hard to dispute their success this year, both teams. So, yeah, props to them for doing good, but it doesn't change the fact that I fucking hate them. <laughs> um, okay. And there we go, we're at 50 points already onto this Miz card. Awesome, awesome. I'm going to definitely finish Miz today. Um, hopefully get at least... Yeah, I want to try. I'm going to try and finish Matt Hardy today. Uh, but I don't know. I really don't know how, how we're going to divide it up and see. But i will just just going to play until I play, really. We'll just see what we do. So, yeah, definitely live stream later on because it's really hard to grind when I'm not streaming. And streaming makes it easier for me and I love streaming. And I hope you guys do love my streams. So, yeah. I'll see you guys then in my streams. Don't forget, guys, do drop a like on this video if you have enjoyed it. Um, straw poll, once again, will be in the description of this video. I will not forget. Definitely won't forget. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Till then, take care. And most importantly, peace out.